So Chapel Street's, you know, in the, the time that I've lived around the area, it's, uh, it's changed a hell of a lot. I was DJing here and I used to go out a lot and drink a lot. We drank a lot, me and my friends, like we did. I didn't know you could just go out and drink a little bit. I thought the goal was to get absolutely drunk. I don't remember most nights out. Someone with a dance floor, really loud music. And just like get absolutely almost blind. Quantity over quality. These days, I don't know. I just I don't really feel like I want to I want to abuse my body to get to that stage. Quite quickly, actually, I think after I moved here, I started to drink less and less. It's just way different now because I'll go out and I'll make sure that I can remember it. And then I kind of found that I could um, still have just as much fun, if not more fun because I wasn't sloppy. A little bit more subdued, more chilled out night. I really don't need to, um, yeah, drink that much. When I go out, I also do so to connect to people on a more intimate and human level and have conversations that require us to be vulnerable and open. Going to clubs have changed into, you know, turn around to pubs because pubs you talk to a lot of people. It's not so much about getting drunk and having dance more about enjoying where you are, enjoying the company, also enjoying a drink. And Melbourne has such like high quality bars and restaurants that I'd, ra I'd rather enjoy them than get really drunk in them. Music is the drug. I say, like, this is Melbourne, like, uh, where people can be free. I don't know, I feel like freedom.